Boom. Oh, balls right into the bushy thing. Ha, I'm alive. Sexy. <laughs> Hello YouTube and YouTube viewers, it is Cody Williams again, and, and, also Raja. Hi buddy, you gonna come watch us? We're gonna do the third installment of the Star Wars Cyber Monday Balloon Tutorial Series. This one's going to be a very silly one. This is going to be a good old fashioned stormtrooper, except it's going to be a dabbing trooper. Raja, can you dab? No? Are you annoyed? Probably. Here you go, buddy. So, Anyways, I'm good now. We're back. So it's going to be a dabbing stormship trooper. Um, yep, I know this is a few months too late, but it's still funny. Kind of. Uh, usually I do this as a dabbing Spider-Man, but I'm trying to make use of this third print in the assortment that we don't quite use as often. So, we're going to do an old-fashioned hitchhiker body design, except that our arms are going to be separated. So for doing this, we're going to blow up two 260s to about six fingers of a tail. and tie them separate, of course. Now you're gonna tie one of them with a long nozzle, like so. Now we're going to do a loop twist followed by an ear twist on each side for his hands, like so, and like so. so keep in mind, one side has a long nozzle. Now we're going to do a longer arm on the side of the nozzle, and kind of soft it too, just like so. Followed by an ear twist. Now on the other arm, we're going to do a normal bend and an ear twist. So it's about almost the same length, actually. It's only maybe an inch longer. Now we're going to connect them at that ear twist up top, the two of them. So I'm going to grab both ear twists, kind of stick shift, grab the bottom two 260s, and twist them. Like so. Now we're going to do a four finger to five finger bubble for the body, followed by two ear twists at the same time. All I'm doing is twisting them together as if it's one balloon, pulling up and twisting. Now we have the Stormtrooper's butt. Now the rest of this is either a Stormtrooper on, storm a stormtrooper on stilts, or we can actually make a four finger bubble ear twist on both sides. Finish off with the legs, so come down to wherever you have about six, seven fingers left, twist it, and make a loop twist ending in a one inch bubble per foot. Do this on both sides, like so. Now, we're going to add his head. Now for the head, of course, the round, below till it's nice and full and before it starts oval, push the print toward the front, tie it. Attach the stormtrooper head to the body, Hide the nozzle. Now, this is a regular good old fashioned hitchhiker. We use this for a lot of designs. It's a very simple line work body design that Ken Stone brought to us many years ago. We still use it so much. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this longer nozzle, I'm gonna pull it over, and I'm gonna wrap it into the two ear twists. And then I'm gonna push the print downward a little bit and into his elbow. I'm gonna take the other arm that we normally have. Actually, I'm straight a little more. I don't know why I bent it out of habit, I suppose. And you've got a very simple dabbing stormship trooper. You can make this with any kind of printed character, but every event I go to now has Star Wars characters roaming around, and I'm always seeing the troopers dab. So I'm making dabbing troopers out of blue. So here is a dabbing stormtrooper, pretty simple line work style. All right, guys, I'll see you again tomorrow for the next design, which I, th I think is. Either a William Falcon or a TIE Fighter. I don't know. See you guys tomorrow on YouTube. Have a great day today and a great tomorrow.